Hey guys, welcome to vtechacademy.com and here in this presentation we are going to discuss identity property. So now let us discuss identity property of addition which can also be called as additive identity property. So here this property states there exists a special number called the additive identity which added to any other number then that number will still keep its identity and remain the same. So here that special number is 0 which is the additive identity. Now let us represent it symbolically. So that is nothing but a plus 0 which is equal to a and 0 plus a is also equal to a. So now let us go for an example. So here 15 is added to a number so that we get the sum as 15. So that particular number will be the additive identity that is 0. So 15 plus 0 is equal to 15. Now let us discuss identity property of multiplication is also called as multiplicative identity property. So here this property states that there exists a special number called multiplicative identity when multiplied to any other number then that number will still keep its identity and remain the same and that special number is 1 which is a unique multiplicative identity which can be represented symbolically as a number a is multiplied to the multiplicative identity that is 1 so we get the product is equal to a so here 1 is multiplicative identity now for example 12 is multiplied by the multiplicative identity that is 1 we get the result here as 12 and similarly 100 should be multiplied with a number so that we get the product as 100 so here that number will be the multiplicative identity that is 1 so 100 into 1 will be equal to 100 now let us go for few more examples now here coming to the first example here 45 should be added to some number so that we get the sum as 45. Here seeing the addition sign we can say that we have to add the additive identity that is 0 over here. We get 45 plus 0 which is equal to 45. And coming to the next example. So here seeing the multiplicative sign the multiplicative identity that is 1 is to be multiplied with 27. So here we get the product as 27. And coming to the next example we have addition sign so we have to add the additive identity so 0 plus 90 we get the sum as 90 and coming to the next example seeing the multiplicative sign we can write multiplicative identity here so 1 into 81 will be equal to 81 so at last we can conclude this by saying 0 is the additive identity and 1 is the multiplicative identity so this was a basic introduction on identity property Hope you understood the concept. Do like and subscribe to vtchacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.